What is going on my fellow floppers and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video guys we're actually going to be discussing how you can go ahead and take advantage of the maximum XP and a broken method that's actually within uh, Cold War at the moment in multiplayer. Now this particular method is going to help you rank up really quick and potentially like level up one to two levels per game. Yeah one to two levels per game. Absolutely madness. But if you guys want to find out what's going on stay tuned. But first of all guys if you haven't already and if you're new around here go ahead and subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications so you don't miss a single video and make sure to go ahead and drop a like if you do enjoy today's video and you find these tips useful so guys there's a broken method within cold war and it's been broken for quite a while and it's absolutely ridiculous and there is a lot of players actually playing it at the minute so it's definitely something i highly recommend all you guys are uh, going ahead and taking full advantage of so first of all guys what you want to go ahead and do is head over to uh, find a match you want to go over onto hardcore if you hit hardcore then <laughs> i do apologize but this is is the, literally the fastest possible way to rank up right now. So head over to Hardcore and you want to go on to Hardcore Newtown 24-7. Now once you're on there you want to you literally want to use shotguns. I would highly recommend either the Gallo SA-12 or the Street Sweeper uh, because if you go on there and you don't use a shotgun you're gonna get shotgun so you're gonna get angry. Um, it's basically join them you know or just don't play it. It's simple as that. Uh, but I would highly recommend joining them and jumping into there. I personally do use the Gallo SA-12 a lot. You will see a mixture of both the Street Sweeper and the Gallo uh, gameplay within uh, within this video. And what we're going to be doing today, guys, is uh, to get the maximum XP and to be farming as much possible XP and the glitched XP as possible. Uh, we are going to be doing what we call medal farming. Now, what medal farming is, is as you can see while we're shooting, and you get your medals, once you get the kills, you get the medals up on screen, so you get your one-shot kills, your double kills, etc. Now, these particular shotguns on Nuketown, if you put the right attachments on there, I can shoot very, very fast. So with that being said, with how far they can shoot, you're going to get one shot kills from long ranges. As you'll see throughout the gameplay, I am killing people pretty quickly with this weapon. So I'll be running around the enemy spawn getting, you know, plenty of kills. I think when I'm on like a 10 kill streak, for example, I'm getting your double kills, your triple kill medals. Each individual medal, you do actually get additional XP bonuses whilst within game. From one of my games, I did actually come away with over 40,000 XP and that's without double XP being activated. So if you was to activate activate double XP token if you, if you have one available. Of course, that's going to be absolutely insane guys. 40,000 XP would then be 80,000. As of this weekend, as I mentioned in yesterday's video, uh, we are actually going to be having double XP weekend. So that will start Friday uh, all the way through to Monday. However, if you are a PlayStation player, uh, you do get the early access to double XP, which will be available to yourselves as of Thursday. So by doing this as well guys, there's another huge thing that I would like to put out there, which is a big glitch within this game. If you was to go ahead and put gunho on your class setup on your perks uh, feel free to do so because this is the best part of the glitch now if you was to hold down uh, to throw either a flashbang or a semtex or something along those lines uh, what what you're doing by that is uh, you actually while you got gunho on you can actually run endlessly um, and you can run and shoot endlessly it's broken you do need to keep holding down uh, the button for your semtex or either uh, your flashbang whichever now I find it a little bit annoying holding the Semtex running around and shooting so I've got two fingers on my right triggers however uh, I do use the flashbang a lot but I would recommend getting used to using it with the Semtex because uh, once you die you're going to drop your Semtex and it's going to blow the guy up if you know the next year if you lost the gunfight and um, so a lot of people are doing that so if you've been playing hardcore a lot on Newtown you'll notice that there's a lot of people just running around and spraying people down that's how to do it guys it is a broken glitch it probably is going to be getting repaired soon I'm not too sure if it does get fixed I will come out with more glitches and different videos like this to go ahead and help you guys rank up if that's something you are interested in let me know down below i do have a few other methods and glitches that are available for you guys in both multiplayer and zombies as well i've not actually touched zombies on this channel whatsoever yet uh, for this particular call of duty like i said not really being around that much uh, so far due to my pc but anyway guys if you have enjoyed today's video feel free to drop a like if you'd like any shotgun class setups um, just let me know down below and i'll uh, give you that information but anyway guys thank you so much for tuning in and i'll catch you on the next video.